Roger, we are green light for extraction. Ammo weapons resupply inbound. Lies on HVT, going loud. Hey guys, welcome back to another Air Splat on Demand. It's me again, Thor. And today we have a very special treat. We're reviewing the Echo One M134 minigun. It retails on our site for $3,899.99 and it is a beast. It's a massive, massive gun. All right, let's get into some specifications. The velocity for this minigun is around 390 feet per second out of the box. We have a nice barrel length of 21 and a half inches on the long barrel and 13 and a half inches on the short CQB barrel. Also, we have the large magazine on the side which holds 1700 rounds and you're gonna need every one of them. All right, let's get into some features on this bad boy. First of all, we have the full CNC metal construction. It is heavy. It is a nice, nice heavy airsoft gun. You have the integrated carry handle on the front right here but you still, I guarantee you, will still need a sling to help carry this sucker around. You have the two different barrel systems. You have the 21 and a half inch barrel and you have the short 13 and a half inch CQB barrel. And also, the barrel system is a very fast, quick change system. As I said before, it's hefty. This sucker's weighing in at a nice 35 pounds total weight. It is massive. If you think this heavy bad boy is gonna come in a cardboard box, you are sorely mistaken. It's gonna come in a nice wooden crate that carries everything that comes with this bad boy, including the certificate of authenticity from Echo One. All right guys, let's get right into the appearance of this bad boy. It is a beast. It is a huge, mean looking airsoft gun that people are gonna run from when they see it on the field. I can't say enough about it, it is beautiful looking. It's all CNC machine metal, just like I said before. It feels good, the weight is just beautiful to hold. My God, when it goes off, people look, no matter what they're doing, they stop what they're doing and they look to see what just made that awful, awful, terrifying noise. And it was this right here. This beautiful, beautiful beast of a gun. So appearance, definitely a, a huge plus with the Echo One minigun in my book. All right, functionality. As you saw in the video earlier, I took it out and had some fun with it. It functions great. Uh, the rate of fire, 6,000 BBs per minute. That's 100 BBs a second that you're spitting out down range. Unfortunately, <laughs> you only have a 70 to 100 round mag. So you're gonna run out kind of quick. You wanna make sure that you can figure out, I figured out some ways to do quick reloads on the field uh, pretty easily, but it's something that you wanna practice with and get used to if you, if you get this sucker and take it out because you do run out of ammo very fast. But other than that, functioning is great. I can't say enough about it. It performs better than I thought it would. Also to go along with functioning though is the power source. We need to let you know about the power source. It comes with a converter box wired to the gun. It comes with your gun, it comes with both barrels, it comes all in that nice wooden crate. The only thing you need to get is a battery. It's gonna take it, a 12 volt battery with at least one milliamp of power. We were running it on a 12 volt, 14 milliamp battery. So you're gonna definitely need to go get one of those batteries because it takes all that power to run this beast of a gun. 
Also go to airsplat.com to figure out how to get stuff to carry the sucker around. As you watch in the video, I had the battery on my plate carrier in the back, the converter box and the pouch on the side, and then I've got my sling carrying the actual gun itself. All things you can get on airsplat.com. You got your plate carriers, you got your pouches, and you got slings. You're gonna need all of it for this bad boy. All right, everyone, let's see how the Echo One M134 minigun performs during our accuracy proven test. As you can see, well, it pretty much throws hundreds upon hundreds of BBs at anything you want, wherever you want it to go. For a bigger picture of accuracy proven, photos, manuals, and more, check out this gun and more on airsplat.com. Durability. I wouldn't worry much about this gun. The weight, the size, what it's made out of, it's heavy duty. If you're running through some brush, through some tree branches, it's going to be just fine. Uh, I wouldn't throw it off any balconies or jump out of any buildings with it, but uh, other than that, I think it'll stand up to pretty much almost any regular field abuse that you can put towards it. But also, for the price that you pay, you might want to take a little bit of better care of it than most airsoft guns. But it's going to stand up to a lot. It's a very heavy duty gun. All right, let's get into the value. I know what you're saying. Thor, oh my gosh, $3,899.99. I know, believe me, I know. But look at what you're getting. You're getting this. You're getting both barrels, the short and the long barrel, 13 and a half inches, 21 and a half inch barrel. You're getting everything you need to run this sucker, that nice wooden box, or certificate of authenticity, everything you need except for the battery, all for that price. I think that value is amazing and you're getting a phenomenal airsoft gun for that price. So I know it's a lot or it seems like a lot, but it's an amazing gun and you're definitely getting what you pay for with this gun. I just could keep going all day with it. Overall, it's beautiful. It's a, it's a very well built, very nice looking airsoft gun. It's definitely something I would want to add to my collection. It's huge. It's got good weight to it. It will decimate anyone that you come across in the field unless they have one too and then that'll be just a good, good gun fight i mean <laughs> who's gonna complain about that watching two miniguns go at it but it's definitely gonna be a great gun to have in your collection i know i want it in mine and i want to take this out on the weekends and just shoot it all day long so overall definitely two thumbs up in my book it's a great gun you should definitely think about getting one for yourself because i'm gonna think about getting one for myself all right guys one more thing i gotta add on before we close this video out this minigun right here will be making appearances at the end of september during air splat's weekend of devastation the 29th and the 30th if you haven't seen a video on it make sure you go to airsplat.com's youtube or facebook page and check out that video make sure you go to airsplat.com to see where this one will be making appearances so you can watch it perform and also get an up close and personal look at this beautiful beautiful beast of a gun all right, guys, this has been another Air Splat On Demand. And as usual, make sure you check out our YouTube, Twitter, Facebook page for all the current updated news from airsplat.com. Again, my name is Thor, and I will see you guys next time. This thing is a beast. It retails for 38 appearances at the end of September, the 29th and the 30th during...